What's going on, gentlemen? You guys are in for a little bit of a treat today. We're about to head down to see my barber, Michael, at RMB Shea Parlor. I've been seeing Michael, gosh, for probably about the last five years, taking care of my hair, taking care of my beard on occasion. Today, we're gonna to focus on the beard. Stay with me, let's go. All right, so here we are at RMB Shape Parlor. This is Michael. And like I said in the car, I've been seeing Michael for, gosh, close to six years, maybe five and a half years. So when you guys ask me about my hair and who cuts my hair, it's Michael. He also kind of helps me with my beard a little bit. So today we're gonna to be doing some beard maintenance. Michael, what are we doing with my beard today? All right, so we're gonna go over the products, what, why you should use them and what they're meant for. So we're gonna start the shave and I'm gonna use all the products that we use on the shave and how you should use these products at home. Cool, so we're gonna do a wash, a scrub, and a beard oil, yeah? Correct. Cool, let's go. So now we're gonna use our beard wash and it's to remove all the dirt and impurities before we do the shave. So I gotta interrupt for a second. Why can't, since this is hair and this is hair, why can't I just use a regular shampoo on my beard? So we have different cleansers for different parts of our body and a shampoo is meant to strip oils because our face okay. and our scalp produce the same amount of oils. And the face, I mean the scalp probably a, a lot more. The oil tends to sit up here and it gets absorbed by this hair. That's why this is a lot softer than this hair. Okay. And the oils in your skin are retained by the skin because it has to move and expand. So it needs it so it can move and not get dry. And if you use a shampoo on here, what it's gonna do, it's gonna actually make it worse. It's gonna strip the oils that the skin has and it's not gonna give it any right. to the beard. Okay. So our Barba face cleanser is designed for the face. So you can use it on your whole face and your beard and it's meant to remove all the dirt and all the impurities without drying out the skin. Perfect, let's go. All right. So now we're gonna incorporate the Barba Beard Scrub. And we're gonna do this right after we apply the beard wash. And you can do this in the shower, save some time and do them right after each other. So how often do I need to do this? You only want to do this about once a week. Okay. Maybe twice a month, depending on your age. Oh, okay. Uh, the reason why is because our skin replaces itself every certain amount of days, depending on your age. So if you think about babies, they have really smooth skin and their skin replaces itself about every 10 to 15 days. And once you get into your 30s, it starts replacing itself every 30 days. Hmm. And once you get to like your 60s, your skin tends to replace itself every 60 days. That's why you tend to see some older people that the skin is kind of dry and it, it's kind of like hanging on right there. Yeah. It like wants to fall off, but it doesn't. So um, exfoliating helps that. And when you have a beard, the skin that tries to replace itself sometimes gets trapped underneath the beard and it doesn't get to fall off. But you don't wanna do it every day or every like week because you can exhaust all the collagen in your skin. It just all depends on your lifestyle and what you like. So now we're gonna finish it off with beard oil. After we wash the the beard and we treated the skin. We're gonna apply some beard oil. So is this more for styling or what's the what's the purpose of beard oil? I'm not a beard oil guy. Um, I just usually use like a face moisturizer. So is this for styling or what, what's the point of beard oil? So remember earlier I told you about um, your, your face needs those oils it has? Yes. 
the, the beard needs some hydration because it's not gonna get it from the skin. Okay. So it needs some type of hydration so it doesn't dry out the skin and start stealing the oils from your face. Perfect. And you can apply this at night if you don't like the shiny look and allow it to soak in during okay. the middle of the night. I like and, that idea. And if you uh, tend to shower in the morning, it's fine. You're at least um, letting it soak in and giving it some hydration. You don't have to reapply again in the morning, but you actually put that in there and it's doing its job. Okay, so that pretty much wraps up my beard treatment. I do want to say though, if you're interested in grabbing any of the products that Michael used on my beard today, I'm going to put a link with a discount code 40 over 10 that gives you 10% off of any of his products. However, the beard oil is so good, it's completely sold out, but Michael is reformulating it. Is that what's happening? Yes, so we're actually putting it in a bigger size with the pump. So you're going to be getting four ounce instead of a two ounce. Sure. And it'll last you longer. Fantastic. Gentlemen, thank you very much. Go check out that link down below and thank you very much for watching. Take care.